a damn woman, man. That's right. The only thing you need to teach her, man, <laughs> is to bend over, man, at the point you know, when you when you you know bid her. Or even in that in, in that movie, uh, Coming to America, man. Even even Semi tried to try to school Hakeem and shit. And said, all you need is a woman with a big backside. Yeah, firm and, backside. And firm back, backside and, and breasts like cassava like melons, melons, man. Right, right. And then this idiot, this clown, he's going to say, I need a woman that intellects my, that, <laughs> that, arouse that, my intellect. that arouse my intellects as well as my loins. Right, right. Now, now Semi, Semi saw what was up, man. And at the end of the movie, who do you wind up marrying? Some ghetto slut from Queens, man. From some skank from Queens, man. And I know that marriage didn't didn't last too long. They ain't show you a part two, yeah. you know. And she and she she probably got half of that goddamn money too, man. That's right. And then he's he's in love with one fucking woman, man. Yeah. He had a woman that was trained from her childhood, from birth, a virgin. to serve him. That was a virgin, man. Hey, he settled for a fucking hoe. Yeah, the fuck's Queens. wrong with you, man? And you gonna find, when you come back to that raw manly state, see if you in America too guy, you've been Amer- in America too goddamn long, man. That's why all you guys are fucking emotional about that whole rape thing, man. Especially right. pol- you polite man. You you are an emotional cat, all right? Now even King King Nobel, even he came out straight, <laughs> man. Wow, look at that. He is, man, he came straight out, man. And just and just let it he said, Look, man, this is your woman, you can do what the fuck you want with that goddamn woman, man. Yeah. Well, he's getting back to that raw raw nature, man. That kingly might mentality. He's a he's a great nut he is he's a great nuts kind of negro. You know? But we're gonna get raw, man. We're not gonna come up to no woman and ah, can I take you out? Yeah, hell no. Can I take you to uh uh, 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 TGIF Can I take you to the Red Lobster Can I take you to City Island Th- And then take you to the movies Or take you to a play And hope that I get the <laughs> pussy Look man <laughs> When I used to well, hey, When I used to deal with women I knew I was going to get something brother At the end of the night Depending on how much money I'm going to spend on your ass Come And on. I let you know I said look That's an exclusive restaurant right there he, he, You know what's going to happen <laughs> After we get finished, you know, we're going to my house, man. That's right. And we're going to do something, you know. That's hey, right. man, I ain't, I, ain't, I ain't bite my tongue, man. If I got with a woman, hey, I, I, I said, look, you know why we together? The, whole, the reason why we together is to do what we got to do. Now, if I got to fucking play games with you, then I'll just I'll give you a, yeah, some money for a cab and go the fuck home, man. I did that. I dropped women. Women played games. I dropped their ass off, get the fuck out of here, and went and got another woman, man. That's right. Okay. Now you get with a woman and she work with you and she helps you out and you you put in years with the woman. I mean, she's to you she's a special woman, all right? Right. right. It ain't nothing wrong with having a, a special woman, <laughs> <laughs> but the the Adam special woman turn into demons too, yeah. eventually, man. You know. Hey, but hey, the, the way you want to be is you want to have no fucking special woman. You just want to have a piece of pussy when you come home, man. That's right. You want to have various pieces of pussy. When you're at, when you know, when you, when you, well, I want Rebecca this night and I want Sarah that night and I want Elizabeth that night. Okay. And that's it. You don't want to be all lovey doll. This, this is my favorite woman. This is my soul oh, fucking no. mate. You know, don't make no damn sense, man. Yeah, there's a whole saying, variety is the spice of life. That's it. <laughs> it says seven women shall take, take hold, hold of one man. That's variety for your ass. It Isn't says, uh, Okay, I'm going to read 8 again. Habakkuk 2 and 8. Because thou hast spoiled many nations. With This is talking about Esau. It doesn't have to say, you know, a simple, bird-brained, slow-minded, concussed Negro. Well, how do you know it's talking about Esau? It doesn't say Esau. I did a word. It doesn't say Esau. Eat him. Nigga, you know because your, your eyes are open up to the scriptures, man. And like you got to lie to these guys, even from GMS, and be asking me these stupid-ass questions. About nothing, man. And I don't answer you. It takes a while for me to answer you, man. You, 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 you guys got to grow the fuck up, man. You got to grow up. You got to look at these scriptures spiritually, man. That's right. That's right. It says because thou has let's see all you gonna wind up like my man. Uh, 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 uh what's it do? Alize, man. He's all fucking bugged out, man. He he actually believes that the three heads. 
in uh, uh, Second Ezra 11 and 12 is talking about Constantine and his sons. And Constantine had three sons. All right, but it said there was three. He had three sons plus himself make four. All right? You're, like I said, brother, your 15 minutes is about up, man. Yeah. You know? Because thou has spoiled many nations, all the remnant of the people shall spoil thee. Because of men's blood and for the violence of the land and uh, of the city and of all that dwell therein. You know, you put hell on everybody, so people going to put hell on you. And, that, and all you niggas that's talking up for the fucking white man, you're going to change your mind. Now, if you don't change your mind, guess what? We're going to change your mind for you. We're going to get you out the picture. And when that revolution come, man, you're going get, to get, get out, you're gonna be out the picture, all right? You stupid-ass niggas down there in South Carolina. Hey, people ain't even talking about them, man. Niggas didn't go down and protest because they said, what, what's wrong with these niggas? You kill my mother, but I still forgive you. Some niggas don't respect your monkey ass, man. I wouldn't even go down to South Carolina, man. I'm pissed off at that fucking place. But you, Uncle Tom, niggas, you niggas are super Toms, man. It says, woe to him that covereth an, an evil covetousness to his house, that he may set his nest on high, that he may... Be delivered from the power of evil. In other words, your plan, you know that this, this place, Babylon, is getting ready to be destroyed. So you have an exit plan. But guess what? Your exit plan is not going to work. All right? You're going to be brought back down here, and you're going you're gonna to gonna have chains slapped on your ass. Uh, Ten verse. Thou hast consulted shame... To thy house by cutting off many people and have sinned against thy soul. For the stone shall cry out of the wall and the beam out of the timber shall answer it. Basically, that's talking about all these buildings are going to be destroyed. Ultimately, Babylon is going to be destroyed by a way of thermonuclear destruction and the return of Yahweh Shai when he cracks them clouds. It says, woe to him that buildeth a town with blood. And America has been built with blood. You built up America by way of slavery, man. All right? By putting hell on people. By working the fuck out of them, man. And, and you think you're not going to pay? You're going you to pay. You are going to pay. All right? It says, woe to him that buildeth a town with blood and establishes a city by iniquity. Let me look up the word iniquity real quick. Yeah, the, the word iniquity is the Hebrew word I I wow, which means injustice, unrighteousness, wrong, violent deeds of injustice, injustice of speech, injustice. Generally, so that's that's what you devils did, and then you really believe you're not, and you look at us like we got three fucking heads. Let me go from here, right quick, and I pass it to y'all to the book of Nahum. Just speak for a minute. Yeah, so you know, so you see these things coming. So it's all it's all uh, percolating, you know, and that's why you seeing a lot of stuff happening, you know. But you ain't seen nothing yet. On the way to the Lord, really open up and start doing some real serious, vicious things, you know. Start allowing chariots to be um, to be seen. You know, strange apparitions and demons, you know, to be uh, manifested, you know, out, out there. Yeah, numbers three and one. Woe to the bloody city. Babylon the Great is a bloody city, man. America. 
Woe to the bloody city. It is all full of lies and robbery. The prey departeth not. The prey is us. We haven't been freed, man. We've been emancipated, but we haven't been freed. And even these black conscious niggas, they wouldn't dare. They wouldn't dare go back to Africa, man. Ain't none of them niggas even went to Africa on vacation. Maybe two or three of them, man. And they'll go for two weeks. They'll take American Airlines or whatever the fuck.